Hey, Jason, do you play any instruments? Yeah, I play two instruments. I play the piano and violin. I wish I knew how to play an instrument. You don't know how to play any instruments? No, my mom gave me piano lessons when I was a child, but I hated it, so I quit. I took piano and violin lessons when I was a child. How long did you take lessons? Ten years. Wow, you must be really good. My mom wanted me to go to a music college, but I wanted to be a doctor. Really? Yeah, my mom was a famous violinist in China. My dad was a famous pianist in China. You come from a very talented family. Thanks. What instrument do you want to learn? Guitar. Oh, I don't know how to play the guitar. We can take lessons together. I wish I could, but I don't have time. Hello. Do you have anything for a little girl? Well, we have some new Barbie dolls. That's a great idea. Show me the Barbie dolls. Here's one. The new beautiful digital Barbie. This doll is hot. How lovely! How much is she? It's only twenty nine dollars and ninety five cents. No problem. Let me have one. That's great. Anything else? No, thank you. That's all I need at the moment. The grand total is thirty two dollars and forty two cents. How would you like to pay? I'll give you cash. Thank you so much for shopping here. Here's your change and receipt. I need to order new business cards. Do you have any idea how many you like? I think two thousand would be enough. Would you fill out this form, please? I don't want to make any changes to my old card. If you detect any difference, I'll take you out to dinner. Okay, that's it. Here's the form, and here's my old card to use as a model. Thank you. Your order will be ready seven days from now. I need it sooner. Let me have it in three days, okay? We can certainly give you faster turnaround, but it will cost you extra. Get up! It's time for you to get ready.、Uh, let me just have five more minutes of sleep. I would, but you need to start getting ready for school. I understand, but all I want is five more minutes of sleep. If I let you go back to sleep, I know that you won't get up in five minutes. Trust me, I'm going to wake up. You have a lot to get done this morning. I already know, and I'll take care of all of that when I wake up. I want you to be on time for school today. I'll make it to school on time. Don't worry. Okay, I'll let you sleep for a little while longer.、Oh, I really appreciate that. My name is Mary, and I will be your waitress tonight. Thank you, Mary. We've been looking forward to trying out this restaurant. Before your main course, would you like to order an appetizer? Sure, that sounds great. Where are your appetizers listed? There is a special appetizer menu right here in the center of the table. The chicken and cheese quesadilla looks good. Is that pretty good? You know, that is one of my favorites. Okay, I'll take an order of that. You could choose another appetizer for half price to share. Perfect. Please add on an order of onion rings. Shouldn't you already be in bed? I can't sleep. I'm really not at all that tired. You need to get some rest, as you have to get up early in the morning. It's impossible for me to get to sleep right now. Just close your eyes and try not to think. That really does not work for me. It doesn't matter. You need to get some sleep. How about I tire myself out and then fall asleep when I'm tired? Then you're not going to go to sleep. Don't worry. I'll make sure and get to sleep in a little while. I want you in bed right now. So sweet dreams. Fine. Sleep well yourself. Hi. I need to speak with the manager, please. Yes, this is the manager. How may I help you this morning? We are having problems getting into our apartment. Is this the first time that you have tried this key since I gave it to you? Yes, this is the first time that we have tried this key. Does the key go into the lock? Okay. It fits in the lock just fine. Let's try it one more time. Just try to gently slide the key in the deadbolt and turn it to the right. It still doesn't work. I will come up to help you right away. I'll bring another key to try. Hello. I would like to buy some business cards. Excellent. How many would you like? 
Two thousand would be fine. You need to fill out this form, please. All I want is the same thing on this card. That will be no problem, sir. Okay, I'm finished. Here's your form and my old card. Very good, sir. Your order will be ready in one week. Do you think you could finish it in three days? No problem, sir. But it will cost you extra. The plumbing in my new apartment is not working. I need you to tell me what the problem is. The bathroom sink is stopped up. Is the kitchen plumbing messed up also, or just the bathroom plumbing? Just the bathroom plumbing seems to have a problem. Did this just start happening, or has it been going on for a while? Everything worked beautifully until a few hours ago. Are you going to be home so I can come by and take a look at the problem? I'm not sure if I will be home later. I will be coming by around ten this morning. If you aren't there, I'll just use my key. Do you know how to draw? Yes, drawing is one of my hobbies. Really? I didn't know that. I doodle when I'm bored. Can you help my son with his school project? Sure. What does he need to do? He needs to draw a picture of a big castle. That's not hard at all. When is it due? Tomorrow. Oh, that soon? Yeah. He didn't tell me until today. Okay. I can come by after dinner. Why don't you come for dinner? That would be lovely. Thank you. Thank you. I cannot draw at all, and I was so worried about this assignment. Don't worry. He will have an awesome castle. Are you going to make anything to go with dinner? I may make a vegetable. What vegetable are you going to make? What kind do you like? I like corn. How would you like me to make it? Excuse me. How do you want your corn? I'd like it grilled. Are you sure that's how you want to make it? I'd love that. That's what I'll do. I really like this beautiful apartment. Thank you. Do you have any further questions? Yes, I was wondering about safety features. Yes, what are your concerns? How about fire alarms and escape routes? Every apartment has its own smoke alarm, and the whole building is on a sprinkler system. What about fire extinguishers? They are in the hallways on all of the floors. It is suggested that you buy an individual one for your apartment. What about escape routes in a fire? The escape routes are clearly posted in the hallways. I want to know how to buy something from this machine. Yeah, the new ones can be tricky. What are you trying to buy? I want to buy one of those snack things. Are you ready to go? I'm clear so far. The money goes in the slot over there. It has to be smooth to go in. It won't go in. Just remember that you might have to feed the money in a couple of times to get it to work. Yes. Next step. Make your selection and hope for the best. Vending machines aren't all that reliable. They're totally unreliable. You seem to have it down. Have a good day. Are you going to take classes next semester? I plan to. Which classes? I will be taking another English and math class. Is there anything else? I'm going to take a psychology class. Are you taking the psychology class as part of your major? It goes toward my GE and my major. So you're just working on your GE right now? Yeah, that's the plan for right now. Why all do your GE classes? I'll be able to transfer once I finish those classes. Does this bus really go to the mall? It goes all the way there. Are you sure? I know it does. I catch this bus a lot. How long does it take for the bus to get there? The bus ride is only thirty minutes or so. Where do we get off the bus? Right behind Macy's is a bus stop. The stop is really at the mall. It's in the middle of the parking lot. That's perfect. I know it is. Hi, what can I get for you? Hello, may I have a double cheeseburger? With everything on it. That sounds great. Did you want fries with your order? May I get a large order of curly fries? Did you want something to drink? Get me a medium Pepsi. Would you like anything else? No, thank you. That's it. No problem. That'll be five dollars and forty-eight cents. Thanks a lot. Keep the change. Could I get some beef? What kind of beef would you like to get? Ground beef would be fine. How many pounds would you like? 
Four pounds is enough. What kind of ground beef do you want? I'm going to need extra lean ground beef, please. I can get that for you. Thanks so much. You're welcome. Let me go wrap the ground beef up for you. Thanks for everything. Hello, Nicole here. Nicole, this is Richard. I think you know why I'm calling. Uh oh, it's about the rent. Yes, this is the second month in a row. I thought there was a grace period. There is no grace period in the rental agreement. Oh, I guess I forgot. Well, when can I expect the rent? You'll get it by Monday. Don't forget the fifty dollar late fee. Is that in the rental agreement? The late fee is circled in red ink. Oh, well, I can't find my copy of the agreement. If you're late next month, I might have to give you an eviction notice. Hi, Julie. How are you? Things are going good, Tad. How about you? Things have been going well for me. That food smells delicious. Let's wander over to the food table and see what's up. Julie, do you know who that woman talking to Lee is? I think that her name is Mary. I think that she and Lee are moving in together. Isn't he with Malia? Malia dumped him. She ran off with a guy she met on vacation. Lee was probably less than thrilled with that. He was kind of relieved. They had been having some problems. Do you want to go to the beach tonight? Sure. Which beach are we going to? I wanted to go to Malibu Beach. I like Santa Monica. The water there looks so dirty. I just like the pier they have at Santa Monica. I like the pier too because it's beautiful at night. Is Malibu Beach nice? It's a lot nicer, and I really like it better. So you want to go to Malibu? If that's okay with you. Sure, let's go to Malibu. I have a few questions for you. What are your questions about? They're questions about the neighborhood. What are your questions? If you don't mind, would you tell me something about the neighborhood? I think the neighborhood could be better. What problems does the neighborhood have? A lot of the streets are rather unclean. What else is wrong with it? Nothing else that I can think of. Maybe in time they will clean up the streets. Maybe they will. I can't get any work done. Why? I've been on the phone all day with angry customers and our technical support department. What's going on? Service is down. It's not working in many areas right now. Do you need help? Yeah. Can you grab some of these calls? Sure. Who should I speak with? You pick. I'll take technical support. You can have the angry customers. Have you bought your bus pass yet? I didn't get it yet. Well, why not? I have no idea where to get it from. You should have just asked me. Well then, where do I get it? You can get it from the student business office. I didn't know that. I know you didn't. I appreciate you telling me. No problem. I'll make sure to get it tomorrow. I absolutely love what you're wearing today. You do? I just bought this outfit a couple days ago. Seriously, it looks really nice on you. Where did you buy it from? I bought it from the Macy's at the Santa Anita Mall. I really like that outfit. Thanks. I think you look nice today too. Thank you. I just bought these new shoes earlier today. Those are nice. What are they? These are some Chucks. Those are great. How much were they? I got them for forty. I think I might go and find me my own pair of Chucks. Hello, is this tried and true rent a car? Yes, it is. What can I do for you? This is Matt. I rented a car yesterday, and I'm afraid I have a car accident near the Central Park. Sorry to hear that. Are you all right? I'm all right, but my wife is seriously injured. Will you call an ambulance and the police? Okay, I'll do it right away. But can you tell me how it happened? I ran into the guardrail when I turned to the right. Can I get some tickets for plays? Yes. Is there a specific play that you want to see? What plays are on tonight? Cats, but it's sold out. Are there any seats left for tomorrow night? Yes. How many tickets do you want? Two, please. Where would you like to sit? I'm not sure. Well, here's a seating plan of the concert hall. How much、uh, is it in the middle section? 
Fifty dollars. Fifty dollars. That's a little too expensive for us. How much is it in the back? Thirty-five dollars. That's fine. What time does the play start? At seven o'clock. What time will the play be over? At nine thirty. I want to return this radio. Okay. May I see your receipt? Certainly. I have it right here. What is the problem with the radio? It has poor reception. Perhaps you'd like a different one. No, thank you. A refund is all I want. Okay, give me a few seconds, please. I need to return this radio. That won't be a problem as long as you have your receipt. Here you go. What's the problem? It doesn't pick up my favorite station. I can exchange it for you. Thanks, but I just want a refund. A refund it will be. Do you have the original box? Gloria is stressed out. Why? The new CTO is visiting our office. So, what's the big deal? It's a big deal to Gloria. She's one of the managers. Gloria is a great boss. She wants to make a good first impression. She hasn't met the new CTO yet. No, this will be her first time meeting him. No wonder Gloria is nervous. What's up? I'm filling out these applications. What applications? College applications. You're in college already. I'm planning on transferring to another school. Which school? I won't know until I mail these applications. Which schools are you applying to? I'm going to apply to NYU and UCLA. I hope all goes well with that. Cross your fingers. I want to fill out the form for a store credit card. Very good. Here's the application form. Okay, I filled out all the information. Here's the form. Thank you. Now I need to see one of your credit cards. Here's my American Express. Thanks. How's it going? I'm fine, thank you. Do you need anything? I need you to help me. What can I do for you? I am looking for an article in a newspaper. Did you check the periodicals? I didn't even bother to think of that. I'll show you where to find your article. I get lost in this library. It's right this way. Thanks a lot for your help. Why is our boss so grumpy? What happened? I asked him a simple question. How did he answer you? He answered so rudely for no reason. What did you ask him? I asked him how he was doing this morning. He's not a morning person. He's not a morning, afternoon, or night person. I think you're right. What can I do for you today? I need to return a book. Can I do anything else for you? I want to check these books out. Is that all? That's all. May I see your library card, please? It's right here. Will that be all for today? Yes, that's it. These are due back in two weeks. All right. Have a good night. Our company is doing a massive recall. What is your company recalling? Spinach. There are reports of E. coli found in some of our spinach. That's scary. I know it can be fatal. Have there been any deaths? We haven't received any reports of deaths yet. What's happening? Not a lot. What about you? I'm having a party next Saturday. That's nice. Are you going to be there? I don't think so. Is there a reason why? I just really don't want to go. How come? I don't really like parties. I wish you would go, but that's okay. I'm sorry. Let's stretch out our brand. What do you mean? Our clothes are popular, so let's make shoes too. Do you mean have a clothing and shoe line? Under the same brand name? Yes, I know a shoe designer who wants to work with us. Okay, let's get started on it. How much is the delivery charge? Five percent of the total order amount. That's expensive. We're buying a large amount of office supplies. Can you give us a discount on the delivery fee? Let me talk to my manager. If we are happy with the service. We will continue buying all of our supplies from your company.
I should have studied harder in college. It's not too late. I can't go back to school at this age. Why not? Lots of people go back to school. I don't remember anything. That's why you go back to school. You get to learn everything over again. Have you met Joanne, my new roommate? No, I have not. I'll introduce you when she gets home. Okay. Is she nice? She's really nice. She's our age, too. Cool. We should take her to the coffee shop later. Great idea. What are you doing? I'm waiting to go on a conference call. Who is going to be on the call? My boss and the vice president. Wow. Are you nervous? Yes. This is my first time talking with the vice president. I really like my work schedule. Do you work flexible hours? Yes, I can choose my own hours. I wish I could work flexible hours. Why don't you? I can't. I'm in accounting, so I have to work regular business hours. Ron is driving me crazy. Why? He has an annoying habit of tapping his fingernails on the desk. Have you told him to stop? No, I don't want to be rude. Well, if it's making you crazy, you need to tell him. Can I have a cookie, Dad? No, we're going to have dinner soon. But I'm hungry. I said no, Billy. Okay, can I have it after dinner? Yes, if you eat everything on your plate. Dave, finally. I'm so glad you called. Where were you? Sorry, honey. I just checked my messages. It was a hard day. You know I'm in charge of a lot of these meetings. Are the lights still out? They sure are. And not just the lights. Everything is out. Except my cell phone, and it won't stay charged for long. Do you have any idea how big this blackout is? No, but I'm getting online to find out right now. Wow, Carla. You should see the map. It looks like the power is out in about five states. Does it say when they think it'll come back on? Let's see. It says here that it might not come back on until tomorrow. Oh, no. I'm sorry I'm not there with you and Maggie. Me too. I'm working by candlelight, and it's very romantic. How can you work without electricity? Well, my laptop is still charged. I think I have about one more hour to work. And what are you working on? A report that's due tomorrow. Oh, don't worry about it. I'm sure your boss doesn't expect you to work in the dark. I know, but it's something to do. Maggie's sound asleep. I miss you both. I can't wait till you get home. Well, just two more days, and the chances are the blackout will be over by then. I sure hope so. If it isn't, I'll go out of my mind. What school did you go to? I went to Millennium High School, founded in 1999. Where is the school located? It's located in New York City, United States. Do you like the architecture of the school? Yes, I do. The architecture is not really impressive, but I like it that the building's architects left plenty of space for lounging. What are the teachers like? Most of the teachers there are helpful and friendly. I especially like Mr. Mike, my physics teacher. How long have you spent there? I have spent three years of upper secondary school there. Is that a single-sex school? No, it isn't. This is a unisex school. Do you like the school uniform? We don't wear uniforms at school, actually. Why do you enjoy the time there? Although I had to deal with quite a heavy workload, I enjoy the relaxing atmosphere when hanging out with friends in the cafeteria there. What important lesson did you learn from school? I learned how to work in a group in which there are many friends coming from different cultures. That's the lesson of cooperation. Will you recommend that school to others? Yes, of course. I am proud to recommend Millennium High School to anyone who is searching for a good place to learn. Where did you buy your last used car? I found my last one in an advertisement in the newspaper, but there are a lot of other places to look for used cars. Besides an advertisement, what else could I do to find a used car? 
My friend bought his used car off of Craigslist. It works out better than eBay because the cars listed are located close by. Is there anywhere I can go to see many used cars all in the same place? Go to CarMax if you want to see the largest selection of used cars in one place. I don't know where CarMax is. Oh, CarMax has many car lots in many cities. For the one closest to you, check out the internet or phone book. Have you ever known anyone who bought a car off a listing on the university bulletin board? You can get a good deal there, especially at the end of the year when students are selling things and returning home. How many kinds of pollution are there? There are many types of pollution. Land, water, noise, air, light, thermal pollution. What type of pollution is popular in your country? The most popular one is water pollution, I guess. Have you ever littered? Yes, I have. But when I was taught the lesson of protecting Mother Nature, I quit littering. What can you do to help prevent pollution? Reduce and reuse whatever I can to eliminate the amount of waste is what I can do to prevent pollution. What does the government do to encourage people to protect the environment? They organize some campaigns to raise the awareness of people. Everything should start from education. Are people in your country aware of the environmental issues? Yes, they are. They care about what happens to the environment around them. Is there any law to enforce people to protect the environment? Yes, the environment law states punishments to people doing harm to the environment. Can you help me figure out the best place to buy a used car? There are a lot of different ways to go. I bought my last one from an advertisement in the paper. What are my other options for looking for a used car? Mm, internet listings are good. Craigslist is pretty good because most of the cars are sold locally. I think that I might actually like to see many used cars together so I can compare them. The biggest used car lot is CarMax. I would check that place out. How can I find out where CarMax is? Uh, look in the phone book or on the internet for the one closest to you. There are a lot of them. Have you ever seen the listings on the school bulletin board? Yeah, the school bulletin board can have some great deals, as many students sell their cars before they return home or as they get better paying jobs. I need a vacation. What's wrong? This job is so stressful, Karen. I think you should ask the boss for some time off. I can't right now. I have a big presentation on Friday. Take a break next week after the presentation. I have another project after this one. You need to make a change. You're going to get sick. I know, but I have a lot of responsibilities. I know you do, but you also have to take care of yourself, too. You're right. I need to talk to the boss and tell him that I need a vacation. Do you think he will understand? I think so. He had a heart attack a few years ago. He understands that health is very important. Okay. I will talk to him today. Thanks for your advice. You're welcome. Where do you plan to go on vacation? A nice warm beach. That sounds great. I traveled to the USA last year with my family. Where is that country located? The USA is located in North America. What is it famous for? The USA is known for its cultural achievements and landmarks. What are the special food and drinks of that country? There are many. They are known for fast food, dairy, and many beverages. What do you like about that country? I like the fast pace of life and the various subcultures. How many citizens are there in that country? The current population of the United States of America was over 324 million in 2016, which accounts for 4.3% of the total world population. What language do people there speak? The national language is English, but many people also speak Spanish, French, German, and Chinese. Do you want to go back there again? Sure. Why do people like to travel abroad? They just want to discover new places, learn new cultures, and maybe speak new languages.